So it's that time we're back and today we're going to be taking a look at some more viewers profiles. As always trying to find a better profile than my own but we all know that's pretty difficult to beat. Well we'll see. Anyway before we do get into the video, if you do go into the video and you haven't already subscribed to the channel please consider doing so. Um, we are getting close to 13k and, and that means we're close to 15k uh, and that means we're close to, to 30k so in actual fact you know we're nearly there. I'm joking but you should subscribe. Also, you should leave a like on the video, it lets me know that you actually enjoy the videos, and it also boosts the video in the algorithm. And finally, my Discord server is the top link in the description, you should join, I mean day by day we're getting close to 4k, it'd be pretty cool if we could get there. Anyway, let's get into the video, I hope you all do enjoy. So as always, we're back on the previous viewers profile review, and to be honest, this, this literally went live for me when I'm recording this video, like 7 or 8 hours ago. Um, so, I mean, we've already got 230 comments, so that's not too bad. I am having to pre-record the videos because when you're watching this, I will currently be on holiday. So, um, yeah, there's that. Nevertheless, as always, I'm just going to close my eyes and we're going to scroll down and we're just going to pick a random comment. So, let's go. Okay. Um, okay, we'll, we'll take a look at this one. I've actually replied to this one. I would love to be featured. My profile isn't that strong. That doesn't matter. Let's take a look. Okay, so I think this is the main profile. So let's take a look at the skills. So we've got enchanting 38, mining 23, combat 27, taming 24. So we've got a skill average of 21.17 um, with 107 out of 228 furry souls. I understand they're annoying to get, but they are very important. So I'd probably just try and get some more to be completely honest. Anyway, let's take a look in terms of armor. We've got this three quarter shadow assassin set, which is 100% fairly strong. Other than that, we've got this Revenant set, it's a Glacite set. In terms of weaponry, this AOTD, uh, this Juju Shortbow, and yeah, it looks like it's pretty much it. All to be fair, that's a very good choice. Um, not looking too bad up to now. In terms of talismans and accessories, 28 out of 78, so 36%. I will definitely look at investing uh, a little bit more into these because, like I said, with fairy souls and accessories are imperative. To be honest, I need to invest in them more too, but anyway. In terms of pets, we've got this level 55 tiger, uh, level 53 monkey. Um, but yeah, to be fair, that's, that's a good choice. Um, I'd just keep working on that level. And in terms of dungeons, it's Cascom's 20, which is not too bad whatsoever. It all seems quite, you know, quite nice, well-rounded early game profile, early mid game profile sort of thing. In terms of slayers, we've got Zombie 5, Spider 3, Wolf 3, and Enderman 3. Not too bad whatsoever. And looking at collections, not too bad at all. To be honest, it all checks out. It, it's a, it's quite, you know, it looks like it's developing quite well, the profile, to be fair. And it is all quite well-rounded, even though it is an early game profile. That doesn't really matter. But yeah, I'd just say stick at it, invest a little bit more time in the furry souls, and invest some more coins in the talismans and accessories, and you should be good. And we're back on the comments again. Let's find another profile. I'm closing my eyes, promise. I do promise. Um, okay. Here we are. Uh, let's take a look at this one. Uh, we will never reach the strength of your profile. At least this person knows. I mean, he's he's got his uh, he's got his priorities right there. Okay, Dirk Mark Seven. Let's take a look. So maxed out taming, enchanting, fishing, alchemy, and runecrafting. Also combat fifty seven, mining fifty seven, foraging twenty five. I mean, this is coming all nicely. He's got all the fairy souls. Um, a scavenge of almost 48, 3.2 mil in the purse. In terms of armory, he's got this shark scale set. Uh, this Necron set with a Warden's Helmet, this Sorrel set, this Werewolf set. Moving on to Weaponry, this Giant Sword, this Daedalus Axe, this Soul Whip, this Axe of the Shredded, and this Juju Shortbow. Looking pretty good so far. And in terms of accessories, 75 out of 78. Very good. A lot of them recombobulated too. And in terms of pets, I mean, this just sort of speaks for itself. Quite a lot of level 100 legendary pets. It is, it is looking pretty good. And in terms of Dungeons, Catacombs 37. Once again, very good. It's looking like a very, very solid profile. And as for Slayers, Zombie Slayer 9, Spider 8, Wolf 8, and Enderman 6. I mean, I'm a bit jealous of this one, to be honest. Collections look really good too. Almost, I mean, there's, there's not many that aren't maxed out. All in all, I, um, I'm a bit jealous of this profile, to be honest. However good that profile was, we all know that i can't even say it i mean I, i'd just be lying if to say mine's better at this point but no no mine's better in one way or another anyway let's get back to it back to the comment section let's pick another one once again mm, let's stop here uh, movie videos nitros i need some advice okay let's take a look i mean if you need advice on on profiles on your profile then you've definitely come to the right place 
Okay, so what have we got? So we've got taming 34, mining 33, um, combat 35. To be honest, like a skill average of almost 31. Like those skills are quite well rounded. So 149 out of 228 fairy souls. So I'd probably try and get a few more. To be honest, um, I don't know how much of a pain they are. I haven't got all of them either, but I'd, I'd probably invest a bit more time into that. Six mil in the bank, 320k in the purse. In terms of armory, we've got this. Um, so shadow assassin boots, um, then half necron, and this livid head. So I think I've seen this before. That's for speed, right? I think it is. Correct me if I'm wrong. And then to be honest, the other armor sets are a bit of a mix match of everything. In terms of weaponry, we've got this livid dagger, which, to be honest, I mean, I'd either put one for all on that or probably go down the Soul Eater route. Like, yeah, you definitely have the enchanting level for Soul Eater, so I'd probably, I'd probably either stick to Soul Eater and then the rest of the enchants or one for all. I personally go for one for all because it's more consistent, but Soul Eater could do more damage. It's one of those. Also, this Flower of Truth. Um, one, one of them again where maybe go for um, ultimate wise or or um, soul eater. I don't know. I mean, it's, pre it's preference at the end of the day, really. He's also got this juju short bow, which I'm not sure whether whether you use this or not. Um, but I'd definitely try and get soul eater on the road as well. I mean, I know it's expensive, um, but that's what I'd probably aim for. And also, there's quite a few more enchantments you can get on there. Um, I'd, I'd just, I'd, I'd try and, I'd try and upgrade this a little bit more if you do use it. In terms of accessories, 44 out of 78. Which is not too bad, but at the same time, 56%. If I was you, I'd be looking to invest some more coins into this as well. Um, and to be honest, I mean, unless you've got things to sell, like I said, you've only got, what, 6 million coins to work with. I'd maybe try and, if, if there's anything that you don't use, sell it and invest it elsewhere. Or try some H flipping or something to get more coins in order to basically upgrade your profile. Like your skills aren't bad, I mean they're quite well rounded. I'd probably say work on getting more coins at this point in order to progress and then work on your skills at another time. That might just be because I don't like doing skills, but who knows. In terms of pets, we've got this level 90, uh, sorry, level 85 baby Yeti. Uh, level 98 silverfish, level 88 sheep, level 85 wolf. In terms of pets, looking pretty good. Also this tiger pet. Then when we take a look at um, dungeons, so catacombs 24, which isn't too bad, once again. Um, I mean, it's just a case of, of basically grinding it out, really. And in terms of slayers, we've got zombie 7, spider 6, wolf 6, and enderman 3. Pretty good, once again. And in terms of collections, it's not too bad. There's quite a few maxed out ones. Um, but yeah, not too bad at all. So to recap, I'd probably just say, um, take a look at your accessories, your furry souls, first of all. And then if you were just to take a look and review the enchantment situation on your Livid Dagger, your Flower of Truth, and your Juju Short Pole, depending on what you use mostly, to be honest. Um, and then just, uh, you just be able to do more damage, that's all I'm thinking about. But yeah, not too bad whatsoever. Can't really complain. And then we'll just take a look at one more profile in this video. I'm sorry if I don't get to your profile, I mean... I don't know how many more of these I'll be doing, but I guess eventually I'll get to everyone's profile if, if I do it for that long anyway. Let's take a look at this one. Agen ducks are great, interesting. Um, we'll love to see what you have to say. Okay, well let's take a look then. Okay, so first of all, um, we've got maxed out taming, enchanting and alchemy. Not too bad. Mining 54, combat 36. Um, foraging 21. Uh, we've got a skill average of just over 40. 157 out of 228 fairy souls. 1.3 mil in the bank. So for skill average 40, I'd, I'd look at the fairy souls. That would probably be... I mean, I've, I've not seen anything else, but that'd be my number one priority, to be honest. I, I hate doing them so much, but they, it's just... They have to be done, and I need to, I need to look at mine as well. In terms of armoury, we've got this sorrow set. This storm set with some wither goggles, this necron set with a tarantula helmet, and a pretty nice collection of golden heads. In terms of weaponry, we've got this Hyperion, and also this Aspect of the Void. I mean, I'm jealous of that Hyperion, to be honest. And as for accessories, so I've got 50 out of 78, um, 64%. I, I'll honestly just, I'll look at the accessories, I'd probably, if I was you, I'd probably be just looking to get some more. Like, I can't, I just can't stress enough how much more damage you can potentially do if you have more accessories. But at the same time, I understand once you get to around that 50 mark, all the accessories that you don't have are probably quite expensive. Um, so it's one of those where you just, if there's anything that you're not using, just sell it and invest it elsewhere. In terms of pets, we've got quite a few level 100 and almost level 100 to be honest. So we've got this Guardian, Silverfish, Wither Skeleton, Tarantula and this Mithril Golem. Also the Sheep Pet, not too bad at all. Um, when we take a look down here in terms of Dungeons, Cascom's 30. Which is pretty good to be honest. I mean, I can appreciate 
it's not easy to get there. And in terms of Slayers, we've got Zombie 7, Spider 6, Wolf 7 and Enderman 3. Once again, a pretty solid showing. And as for collections, it's not looking too bad either. There's quite a few matched out ones there. Not too bad at all. But all in all, it's a pretty solid profile. Um, I'd just say maybe invest a little a little more coins into, into accessories, although I don't know if there's any more coins hiding anywhere, but you, you only have 1.3 mil, so realistically you're probably not going to be able to get much for that in terms of any more accessories. And also furry souls, they cost nothing but time and pain, uh, but it's worth it in the end, to be honest. Anyway, this is going to be the end of the video. As always, if you do want your profile reviewing, then make sure just to leave your IGN in the comments of this video, and if you're lucky, I might pick your profile. Anyway, I hope you all did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you do leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you in the next one.